Okay, we're back to play episode one, final season of The Walking Dead. Whew! Now we're actually getting to the actual game. So, from what I remember, the car crash just happened. Okay, where's AJ? AJ! Damn. Okay, where are we? Tear off the tape. Okay, that, that was too easy. What is this place? It's a room with bunk beds. All right, I hear footsteps. Memories. <laughs> All right. So family of three? I mean, three siblings? Is there anything up top? Take it. Where the hell am I? I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> hmm. Can I not reach it? Can I just jump and get it? <clears throat> All right. I guess I'll have to get that chair. I actually have to. Okay. do all right is that not footsteps is that just the house settling right, so. damn she did it with ease I didn't even test if that door was locked That say fuck you. <laughs> Are we in a school? <laughs> Should have closed the door. Wait, that's not AJ. Wait, that is AJ. Wait, that's not AJ. Let me disarm him. Drop the knife now. You do the same. Wait, we're not gonna hurt you. We've got your boy. He's safe. If you want to see him again, you'll drop that knife now. Guys, see, all good here. Look, if we wanted to hurt you, we would have by now. Considering the circumstances, I'll let this little standoff slide. But you only get one strike. Now, 
You gonna behave so I can take you to see your boy? Because if you really want to fight, you're a little outnumbered. I'm pretty sure Cleek Look, me that. I'm sorry. I Cleek. didn't know where I was or who you were. I just want to see the boy I was with. You could have just asked. Not in this world. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in a pretty rough shape when we found you. Yeah, well, you didn't tell me properly. Precautions, you know, just in case. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. I'm Marlin. That's Tennessee. But, uh, call him Ten for short. He's one bit taking care of you. Oh, now I feel bad. Much. Clementine. Come on. Let's go see your boy. Oh, thank you, Tennessee. Oh man, now I feel bad. I mean, like, it was reasonable. If I was in that situation, I would disarm a guy with a knife and then ask questions. Holy shit, where are we? I think we are in the school. Surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? Of course I do. I usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I can't imagine what that must have been like. Sure, I do what I can to get by. No matter what. But don't worry about it. We all do what we have to. Does Tennessee not talk at all? It's good we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. The walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. Fuck. Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we Chucky had looking ass. Smoke. I... Appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. I've seen some rough scenes. Uh, hi there. What's his problem? You're just new. I mean, we haven't seen anything like you and ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well, I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and a good location too. No one really comes out this way anymore. We've you carved ourselves the perfect camp. Kids are safe here. We make sure of it. No adults. At all. It wasn't always like this though. People leave. They die. There's less of us all around. Hmm. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. Troubled youth. You and your boy. Feels like you both fit that description. It's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit troubled. I was pretty good as a kid before everything changed. Made a lot of trouble since then. We all had to grow up fast. I'd say that goes double for your boy. Hmm. It's been a little terror since he arrived. <laughs> Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Okay, people do talk. I need to take care of this. All right, people you know, do Willie, talk. Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. I think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. You get a move on, Willie. Where's right. your damn weapon? Hmm. Kind of like this Marlin guy. I like this 
this area we're in better than the other spots. Follow the music. Check. Some creepy music. Okay, what I want to know is why does it say fuck Eris Erickson? Justin fuck the wall. Oh, that's so fucked up. believe you. AJ wouldn't do something like that. I'm telling you, he would. And he did. And you've got the nerve to say you don't believe me? Screw you. Well, I didn't think she would say you won't. Alright, whatever. Fuck you. Hmm. Before we go there, let's see what's on... Unless we... Do end up going upstairs. Hmm, can't go this way. Where is that music coming from? Well, no fucking shit. Okay, well that was pointless. Something tells me we're gonna end up going upstairs anyway. Right, let's talk to piano man over here. There's my boy. You were all right he doesn't eat. don't worry about me I'm not going anywhere not anytime soon but AJ listen to me that girl out there says you bit her is that true that's not Can't cool doing that kiddo these people helped us I didn't mean to. She snuck up on me. Still, no more bites. No more bites. You're not dead. That's good. Watch your kid for you. My name is AJ. Excuse me. I watched AJ for you. Hope he didn't cause you any trouble. He was a bit of a handful. Thank you, but Corbin Blue. I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't like so people, people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. Loud and clear, little man. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Lewis. Clementine. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. They didn't take our- they didn't touch any of our shit. Um... Double, um... Does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude! That can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. Is it actually loaded? Yes. Oh, good. I'll guarantee he's a better shot than you. Hey. You guys do your thing, I guess. You don't know any others? Well, there is one. But you're armed. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Can you play something else? Dreadful sorry, Clementine. <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud, 
It is. Loud is bad. Not always. Oh Come my god. Come press this he... key. Come on. This one right here. He's been taught. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. He's just following a system. He's, he, taught, he said loud is bad. Oh, he's never seen a piano. Now press this too. one. And this one. <laughs> You're a natural. Hey. Have you seen Rosie? Yeah, nope. There's the problem. Shit. We've got a bit of a situation out there. Um <clears throat> to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? Deadheads. You too, Lewis. Get your ass in gear. <sighs> Fine. What I want to know is how Clem's hat still fits her. It does. It looks like the hat got bigger. Hey, Rosie, where the did hell the, is she? Did the hat grow as she grew? You give her her weapon back. Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. We need our help to clear the way. Seems to be a few more than usual these last couple days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Okay, Vi. bitch. Vi. But just saying, there's got to be some explanation. I don't think we've met. I'm Clementine. Yeah, I know. Your kid won't stop talking about you. Uh, um. Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. What he said. All right, boys and girls. They're starting to fill in. Come on. Be careful out there. Don't mind Violet. She, uh, grows on you. I promise. Oh, this? It's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. Oh my god. Corbin Blue's too much, man. <laughs> Wait, let me help. I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. You'll get your moment, AJ. No worries. You'll get it. Okay. There's a cleaver. Clem, monster. Right. I'll show you guys how to done. You. Okay, okay, uh, no, 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 we did that didn't happen. Redo, 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 redo. Let me help. I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. It didn't tell me, man. It's, it's not my fault. Clem, monster. Fuck, he did tell me. I have no excuse now. All right, I forgot how to play. Okay, why are you taking so long? Oh my god. I guess I have to actually stun it. Alright. Stun. Stun. Alright. Oh, uh, then I'll stun this one. Boom. Oh my god, they get back up. Alright, I'll stun it and then kill it. Nice work, Clementine. Could use a little more finesse, though. Watch and learn. Hey, over here. Follow me. Oh my God, he's gonna. Eat... Oh. And that's how you school a walker. There's a whole bunch of traps laying around this area for these ass hats. They're all marked, so keep a look. This is like uh, Naboo. Not in a boot, but that's that map in, uh, in Star Wars Battlefront. Okay, okay, chill. He's in the range. Mm. Okay. 
Okay. Looks like they made it back in one piece. Come on, meet them halfway. Oh my god, take forever. You take forever to kill somebody. Oh my god, there's a fourth! There's a fourth! There's a fourth! Bam, baby. Okay. Go! Over here! Nice timing. We're not gonna be able to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk when we're back inside the gates. Keep an eye out for those stragglers. Are huge rabbits. Are those rabbits? You know, you're not half bad, considering the circumstances and all. Thanks. Let's finish these guys off. We don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school. Let me save him, let me save him. I'm pressing kill. Okay, dog. Okay. <laughs> All right, dog. Chill, chill, chill. Good girl. Shh, shh. Hey, hey. It's all right, girl. It's all right. Hey, see you and Rosie are making friends. That's Rosie. Had a bad experience with the dog once. Well, Rosie here can help you get over it. She's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. So, this is the squad. That walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right. Fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking starving. You're not the only one. How'd it go out there? How do you think it went? Be nice, Asim. The safe stone's nearly dry. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. B minus then. Now, Clem here. That was a solid A. A plus even. Nah, it's not. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. I know. You're both delusional. <laughs> Alright, I think I fuck with Violet. I fuck with Violet. They're pretty good with the monsters. Come on, y'all. Food's in the <sighs> AJ! <sighs> oh, <shit>. Fuck. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. It, it happens sometimes. <laughs> He's a jumpy little guy. You gonna be okay? He can't go around punching people in the... You know, and expect me to eat at the same table. I'll talk to him. <sighs> hey. Hey. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? That's gross. He should stop. Surviving, man. The same thing we're doing. Surviving. But we don't eat monsters. 
Yeah, but if we could, we probably would. I wouldn't. Whatever you say. I wouldn't. Gross. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. Yeah, me confused. Jane, I'm sure they'll forgive you, but we should go talk to them. But... but I don't think they like me. I can just tell. They don't. They don't know you, AJ. I'll bet when they do, they'll like you just as much as I do. I don't know. Marlin was really mad. And that girl I bit, she yelled at me. They're really scary. <sighs> AJ, listen. We haven't eaten for days. AJ has The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. So we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. It's because AJ hasn't interacted with anyone other than Clementine. He doesn't know how to act around other people. Alright, speaking of other people, let's go learn their backstories. Alright, let's start with this bitch. There's that girl I bet. Oh. Yeah, wanna talk to her? You mean, say I'm sorry? Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta... Tell her why you did it. Because of my... thing? Yep. It's nothing to be ashamed what of. Thing? Just be honest. You're thinking about hitting people? Don't you get surprised? Yes. I'm sorry I bit you sometimes. When I get scared, I do that, but I don't mean to. I just... I just get scared, and I'm sorry, and I hope your finger is okay. No, oh, Shug, it's alright. We can all get a little crazy when we get scared. Thank you for your honesty and your apology. I did it! You sure did. <laughs> right after you apologize. I did it! Right in front of them. Gonna talk to her? No? Alright, sick. Alright. Mitch and Willie. Hey. Hey, you're new. I am. I'm carving a weapon. Uh, yeah, I can see that. That reminds you of You're good at that. Will's brother from Stranger Things. You like that, huh, little dude? Want to see something cool? I want to see. <laughs> Pretty rad, huh? That's how you fuck up some monsters. Swear. Uh, I'm sorry. Mmm, <laughs> yes. Redolent of rose. Hey, guys. Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Eh, excuse me. Chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's not ready yet. Omar's a perfectionist. The slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat, or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. That's a good chef. That's a good chef. Asim. Hello. Hello. Oh, hey. It's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. Asim, right? What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm, like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. Those who do not learn from the past and all that. You seemed really mad at Marlin like back there. a good there. idea? He keeps pulling back to safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt. Which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. She... Hey, zip it! That is not yours to read, kid. Give it back. It was just sitting there. So? So it was just sitting there. We gotta AJ, teach AJ. Give it back to him. Okay. Thank you. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. 
Gotta preserve what I can, you know? I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be, like, rude, but, you know. Bye. <laughs> what the fuck? The way he said it, it. I'm pretty sure we're gonna... Okay, I'm, like, metagaming this, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to make a decision. About between these two. I'm not ready. Not yet. What do you mean you're not okay. ready, AJ? Come on, Let's man. Let's talk to someone else. I already talked to everybody. What? Oh. Oh, okay. Never mind. Guess not. Oh, hey guys. Fuck. Oh, this Tennessee man. Yo, I feel bad for Tennessee, dude. Knock it off, Ten. Heard you guys didn't have the best introduction. It wasn't my fault. Ten. I did what I had to to protect myself. I was trying to help. Oh, man. She didn't know that, Ten. I bet you'd have done the same thing. I guess so. What is this? Our Fuck, graveyard. I should have said sorry. You guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody really. This is where we buried ten sisters' belongings. Oh. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them. Both about a year ago. Oh my god, dude. I feel so bad for him now, man. Fuck! Respects. Should we do that too? That's so sad. Hell yeah, man. Maybe? Yes. Yeah, yeah I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. Thank you. Clem? Yeah? I'm ready. To talk to Marlin. Okay. Yo, fuck this up, AJ. Where'd AJ go? He's literally right in front of me. Alright. Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a sweet little fella. Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweetness still out there. I'm the lucky one. He's just naturally good. Naturally good? That's rare stuff. Yeah, right, naturally <laughs> good. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? <laughs> that apology. Well, don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You. Regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Stew's done! Hey. You guys earned your supper after all. Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is served. <sighs> Thanks. Wow, I can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mmm, this is really good. <clears throat> Frick, AJ. <clears throat> oh, come on! <clears throat> Where are your manners, AJ? <laughs> Good night. Are you kidding me? Good night. You didn't even finish your food. Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. What do you mean? She didn't even eat her food. She ran away. Eat hers. Have the rest. Are you sure? You bet. <sighs> I'm all done. Mm-hmm. Me too. Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very important. Okay. Oh, God. Good night. Violet, it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? 
War. War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only okay, game what Clem there say? is. I don't think she's I don't ever know played the game. It. The only card game I've played I have less it. people. Don't worry. You'll pick it up as we go. It's easy. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner gets to ask Clem a question. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. And what if I win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. Ooh, wait, what about AJ? Where the hell did he go? <laughs> Looks like he's made a friend. AJ and Ten are boys. You can take your eyes off him for one card game. Bet you both could use a break from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Lewis, if you would. What is RNG, man? Way to go, me. So, about AJ. This is a 3 vs 1? Where are AJ's parents? Oh boy. You two don't really look related, so... What happened there? You gotta play by the game. They're really. dead. They were nice people. For the most part. It makes sense. I remember He's that. He's a nice kid. For the most part. Okay, I get to ask. Hey, I win. Hey, you do. So, what do you want to know? What's up with your haircut, Marlin? <laughs> oh boy. Savage. Uh, what do you mean? She means it looks like a dead cat. Probably smells like one too. Fuck. Uh, I look cool. <laughs> Whatever you say. I say I look cool. <laughs> Booyah! Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh... I knew it, man! Ever have a boyfriend? Fucking Corbin oh Blue's trying to get on God. Clem, man. What? It happened. Perfectly valid question. You can ask me if I've ever had a girlfriend. Was there I haven't, by the way. Oh, I'm sure she's real surprised about that one. That's a yes. You don't know shit. I know. Wait, what I thought I, I clicked. Know. Ah, I win. So, Clem, you can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Lee. Family? Anyone? Lee. The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? How to let go? How to say goodbye. Oh man, that's so fucking deep, man. Fuck. I win again. You do indeed. Ask away. Met anyone famous? You guys meet anyone famous out there? No. Too bad. You'd figure a movie star or something would show up somewhere. They had like millions of dollars. They're probably living in a bunker with butlers and waterbeds out the ass. Yeah, maybe. I met a guy who used to be a baseball player. Like, for money. Oh, That's yeah. Cool. I used to love baseball. Was he good at it? Don't know. We never got to play. He was good with a bat, though. Baseball sucks. You suck. Not as much as baseball. <laughs> what are the victory violent? Here's something odds, I love to ask man? when I'm in groups. These odds are mm. bad. Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? Oh that is fucked up. <laughs> oh I know. Anyone but me. Any Lewis, definitely. Ooh, definitely. Okay. definitely. 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 
What? I'd have said the same. He's the guy that would take a joke, you know? I am the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. <laughs> Ever? Actually, never mind. Oh, God. Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Oh, God. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Lee, man! Fuck! Lewis. Hey, she wanted me to ask. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. <laughs> yeah, worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, that's uh, probably for the best. A uh, good call. You Man. wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Uh, good night. Night, AJ. Did they even talk? Was he drawing the entire time? <laughs> long day, huh? Yep, real long. That's awkward. I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. You guys relax. Get some sleep human for a night. In the morning, come find me and talk about making this long term. We can stay? We can talk about it. Oh, man. Rem Remembering that scene, I think that was the first and only time I've ever cried playing a video game. Fuck, man. Lee's death was oh fuck. That looks like a really safe window. It does. Good. Huh. Why is it so quiet? This box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? Oh. It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like tin? Yeah, like ten. Huh. I like to do pictures too. Oh, shit. I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Uh oh. Where the hell is it? Oh. What? That's what I was looking for. Oh, it she's belonged to Sophie. Oh, Sophie. Fuck. Uh, Ten sister. He was asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry. We didn't know. No, no. It's it's fine. Don't don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's... it's fine. Do I need to make a choice? It's alright. She says you can keep it. Wait. Okay. Why have I been fucking up 10, man? 10 will be disappointing. Huh. I see you're... I was thinking like... In. I would s help AJ learn about yeah, art. is that okay? Sure. I guess. Oh. I always liked this room. Sophie had, like, paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. Did she die recently? And Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice. Real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. That was a long time after ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. Do you mind us being here? 
in their room? Huh. It's... it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad, actually. I'm glad it's getting some use instead of just sitting around picking up dust. What exactly happened to them? Sophie and Minerva. They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. What if they're alive? Honestly, I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. And I'm not exactly like a people person, you know? I know I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. Yeah, me too. First impressions aren't exactly my strong suit either. Oh, right. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. See, that's why a little... We could give it back. We could give it a 10 Not after. Not bad, kiddo. I should be getting back. Enjoy the art supplies, little man. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Why was that so awkward? <sighs> okay, Alvin Jr. Time for bed. Shit. Okay. Here. For me? Oh man. For the wall. To make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. How about here? I can decorate the room. You see, uh, I, AJ? I wouldn't have gotten that drawing. Wait, how can AJ have... Oh. There's a bed. Hey there. What are you doing? Has he not seen a this bed? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. You're gonna get cold down there. The bed's a lot warmer. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? <sighs> Nobody's gonna come in. Trust me. That girl just came in. He's so programmed. If I stay like, here, no one can find me. Be and safe. I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. AJ, listen to You've me. You gotta learn. It's gonna be okay. Please just give the bed a chance. It's soft and warm. I think you'll really like it. Has he never he never slept on a bed before? Oh, bro. That's so sad. It's not like he has though. Like he has he's had given the chance. Hmm. This bed is really soft. Told you so. It's really, really soft. Good night, AJ. I ain't letting AJ sleep Clint? on the damn floor. Hmm? This place is nice. I'm glad we found it. <sighs> Me too. I wonder what's gonna happen. And I think that's a good place to end. Yep, we're definitely going to go upstairs later, but I think that's a good place to end. So, I will see you in the next part, I guess. Peace, peace!